can't handle, handle it. it. Welcome back. Can't handle we dancing. are continuing our game of the trail at House on the Hill. Club can't yeah. handle it. Uh, it's Dice yeah. turn. So the creepy little girl now <laughs> needs yeah. to leave the graveyard. I know. I need one more die so I can do a sanity roll. Previously, can I shit have? went That's down. True. Now she has to roll to get out. <laughs> yeah, I beat four. I can go. So Everyone's one, two, today. three. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> God, I just, I, I just, I love <laughs> staring into the. Oh, I found the chapel. chapel. That's Sandy. Yes, it is. I'm going and around. an event. Like every yeah. time I play, this chapel's connected to the entrance hall. No one's hasn't. Uh, but it, it's, it's usually upstairs. It's usually upstairs. one for me. Okay. <sighs> like four. Can I read my event? Okay, my event. <laughs> you, she's gonna murder the shit out of you later when she can. Like, I'm gonna she, become the, the traitor. No, the she's traitor gonna murder the shit out of him tonight after we all leave. <laughs> <laughs> he will be the ghost messing with the game. We'll after. hear about it. Okay, okay so my like, event. Oh, happened? The Mystic Slide. Anyway. If you're in the basement, that, that this event affects the next explorer to your left, not in the basement. Discard this card if all of the explorers are in the basement. The floor falls from under you. Damn You're it. in the basement, I think. Place the slide token in this room, then attempt a might roll slide to token. use the slide. Okay. Slide um, token. I, I need another one. Did you build a slide? Yes, I built the slide. In you the chapel. We're like in the church and just might, like, well, well, we don't need the floor. The floor. <laughs> We don't need the floor. Let's no, put a slide in. That's that's like, you know children. what would be really cool here? It a slide. A slide. Yeah. Are you ready to slide? Yeah. Yeah. It's gonna be I right do there. have quite I get, I get to do a mic yeah. roll. Let's see how I do. Hopefully, I manage to get a five off of three. Let's do it. We'll see. You did. Whoa. Draw tiles from the room stack until you draw a basement room. That was fast. Place the room <laughs> tile. <laughs> and no basement rooms are in the stack. Choose a basement room and play. You fall to that room and take one die of physical damage. If it's not That's your turn, right. don't draw a card sure. for that room. On later turns, any explorer can attempt this roll. Should we the move slide? the basement? Oh, oh, yeah, that's safe. Let's put the basement over, the basement over here. <laughs> the basement I just good. landed in the pentagram chamber. I like I'm, how the chapel's gonna I'm gonna the read it. Chamber. Shh. I'm gonna read this first. When exiting, you must attempt a knowledge roll of four plus. If you fail, you lose one sanity, but continue moving. Basement. Great. Now let's get an omen. Well, so not a symmetrical house. So many omens. No, it's not. On, oh yeah. Also, They're just all over the also place. on later turns, any explorer can attempt this roll to use the slide. So any it's gonna explorer. go right there. We'll leave that there. Any explorer. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh! I got a skull. A skull cracked and missing teeth. That's not, that's not, <laughs> not cute. Why? If you take mental damage, you can take it all as physical damage instead. Oh, guess what? Card. Guess what? I'm supposed to take a one die of physical damage. That happens, that happens first. Before. Yes. Oh, okay. Damn it. Ooh. Too physical. The other thing that we didn't really explain is that there's mental and physical traits. There's two of each, and you can divvy them up however you want to when you take that damage. What else yeah, is physical? So sanity and knowledge is mental, and might and speed is physical. Look at that camera. There's a camera there. <laughs> I don't really want to look at that camera. Sure, I don't that's, feel like that's speed. It's <laughs> might. That's sanity. It's knowledge. Look <laughs> <laughs> at it. I don't look at it. it. <laughs> look at it. Oh, that was upside down, I think. Okay, now I have to skull. What way is upside down? When you're I must make a haunch roll. Top of the camera Can still I get three up. more die? It's, you guys have that over there. Me and Sarah have the bottom of the camera. I need three. I need three. Or else I can't do the haunch roll. One, three. Alright, one, you, you get two. Oh, so we're gonna start the haunch? I hope not. I hope so, because I'm in the pentagram chamber. I wonder what happens. I need a four. I haven't had a chance to build my staff back yet. Just do, just do it. Do it. Ah! She did it. Damn it! Totally did that. Yeah, wow. Rolled the shit out of those wow. Days. Wow. They're taking shit out of those Not even a thing. Oh, no, but shit. They're ghosts now. They have a skull. Like everything else yeah. in this house. The I feel like bitch. you're trying to make out with the camera, but I like from far to. away. Do you want me to? <laughs> Is that what you want? Is that what oh, oh, oh. the viewer hey. wants? Is that what you want? Wait, the we viewer? must read uh, the haunt. Mass. Or the thing. You got a mask. A somber mask to hide your intentions. 
Once during your turn, you can attempt a sanity roll to use the mask. That's nuts. Four plus on my sanity means I can put on or take off said mask. Are you that sane? Putting on the mask, I gain two lunge and lose two sanity. And the reverse happens if I take it off. And then if I fuck it up, I can't use the mask. Okay. Well, you might as well use it. Too much. Well, she's gotta do a haunt roll first. Too much. Too much. What did you too just do? Why too much? Hashtag too spooky. Too spooky. Stop hashtagging! <gasps> Yay! In the hot sauce! Okay, so wait. Oh, Everybody. that was Quentin. The haunt consists of a traitor and the rest Scary. of us. The traitor gets their own book, and it also determines what haunt we have. Inside Mass is a haunt chart. And we decide that based on the room, the haunt began, like mask in bed and the yeah, item yeah, that's like in the room. That's super oh. kinky. <laughs> that's a really kinky shit. It's one of those leather masks. Would you swear? Is it you? Haunt in the uh, mask, mask in the bed. <laughs> Not bedroom. Master Master bedroom. Mask. What? Mask. Zipper mask. In bed. The event number. Okay, so the event number is thirty-five. So we go to the list of numbers here. The person with the highest knowledge is the traitor. I have six. Oh, I have job. five. I have, I have. I, like I think five him. is better than so six. So it's just, like, So, this event is called Small Change. Small. A couple of tabby cats have been prowling about the house. They look peeved, but have left you alone. Cats are the scariest creatures here. You don't have much to worry about. A sound breaking glass jerks you away from your musings. <laughs> you turn to see a broken vial on the floor. The silver liquid oozes out and turns into a sparkling cloud that surrounds you. You grow queasy and dizzy for a few moments. When your head clears, you're staring up at the chair, its seat seemingly miles above you. That makes you roughly the size of a mouse. Then you hear a sound outside your room. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> meow! Okay. Meow! <laughs> <laughs> See, on certain events, it doesn't matter if he hears that. He just turned us into cats. The asshole. Oh, <laughs> you turned us into yeah, cats? Or no. Yeah. Meow. Right now, we okay, we have some rules that we have to go through. Um, right now, we set aside a pentagonal item token to represent the toy airplane. That's going to be... We're not cats. We're us. The cats yeah. are mice. No. You said what? he turned us into cats. We're not cats. When your head clears, you are staring up at the chair. It seats seemingly miles above you. That makes you roughly the size of a mouse. Then you're a mouse. We're a mouse. No, we're the size of a mouse. Yeah, what is going on? We're tiny. What did I say that made you, you said all we confused? Were cats. He just turned us into cats. He turned us into cats. I yes. said that he turned us in. That he shrunk us. That's you said he turned into cats. That's what I meant to say. <laughs> no, that's not what I meant to say. Anyways, um, Stuff. what we know about the bad guys. The traitor has shrunk you and let the cats into the house. They will try to eat you. We are mice. Nice. They're going to try to kill us. We are. Um, yeah, we, are. we just need that pentagonal item token. This one. Item. On it. That's a plane. So that's important for us. We need to get to that. Plane. Do we put it where we want? We have to get to the plane. Uh, no. There's somewhere that it goes. Does it go into the pentagon? It's in the bedroom, the master bedroom. Damn it! So it goes up there. So where all this stuff? <sighs> let me read us the rules, and please let me. <laughs> play you, if you're not going to listen to me read you the rules of how to play, then we're not going to be able to play. <laughs> Being small, all items and omens you are carrying have shrunk with you and function normally. You can't draw any cards. Discovering a new room with a symbol ends your turn. Oh. <coughs> right. All right. Each doorway counts as a space, so moving through a doorway to the next room counts as two spaces. You can stop in a doorway space. You must make a might roll of three plus to go up or down any stairs. If you fail, you end your turn, but can try again next turn. If you can't use the collapsed room or the mystic elevator, you are not affected by the gallery, gymnasium, or vault. You need the toy airplane to leave the house. What? Oh, okay, so never mind, it's not actually in that room. It can be in any number of rooms. I'm gonna go over those again. It is in rather the bedroom, the master bedroom, the storeroom, the attic, or the game room. Once during your turn, you can attempt a knowledge roll of 3+, plus to search one of these rooms. 
If you succeed, put the toy airplane token but the in that room. The knowledge room? Oh, we can't use the collapsed room. In the so if we're in the collapsed room, we just move normally instead of having to do that roll if, to see if we yes, fall? Yes, we don't fall. Okay. Well, we can't use the collapsed room, so we can't go through. I'm stuck. Is that in the week? <laughs> <laughs> There's a the bathroom. You're gonna have There's to come him. save me, guys, because here's the thing. Okay. We can't go through. Well, that's through. what I'm getting to. Let me finish well, the rules. Let me finish. Just... This is important for using the toy airplane. If we find it, once you're in your turn, you can attempt a knowledge rule of four plus to start it. If you succeed, it will stay on the ground until your next turn. During this time, other heroes can board the toy airplane, but any heroes can be attacked by cats. Oh, no. Or in it, any heroes can be attacked by cats. The toy airplane has a speed of five. When it is flying, the hero who started the airplane moves it on his or her subsequent turns at the airplane's speed instead of using regular movement. Like Shrunken Explorers, it counts doorways as separate spaces when moving. So it gets like two and a half spaces, kind of thing. Picking up a hero on the ground with the toy airplane counts as one space of movement. When you do this, the hero in the plane with the highest speed attempts a speed roll. Um, the die rolls go four plus, you pick them up. Two to three, you fail, but you can try again. Um, it cancels another space of movement. In zero to one, you crash, and the toy airplane is on the ground, and you must restart it. Oh, okay. You can't leave the house until all living heroes have been picked up. Spend one space of movement to exit a room's outside facing edge. Ooh. Flying heroes can attack or be attacked only with the revolver, ring, or dynamite. You have none of the above. <laughs> can we find items once you're in the plane? No. No, we can't find we items. Can't items at all. <laughs> We're done, we have our stuff. That's all that she wrote in the book. But he can find it. Flying heroes do not need to make my rolls or sure. two stairs. They can go up or down He's through the classroom and gallery. And they pass well, across the chasm, the chasm without rolling or taking damage. The trader can't fly the toy airplane. <laughs> okay, there's some rules about if a cat catches you as well. If you're captured by a cat, you have a chance to get away. At the start of your next turn, choose any trait. You and a cat each attempt a roll using that trait. This is called contest. Oh, okay, that's just a cool thing. If you roll higher than the cat, you escape and take your next turn normally, otherwise you're still captured and your turn is over. If another hero attacks and defeats the cat, the cat drops you and is stunned. Heroes currently captured by cats cannot be picked up by the toy airplane. That's horrible. That's pretty much all there is to it. If you need to reference it, it's number 35, and I'm just going to leave that there. Um, yeah, I guess we're ready for Jared to come back. Should, should we go see? Now that your experimental subjects are all safely in the house with your cats, it's time for the real fun to begin. Dropping the big girl shrink it all, you watch as the silver liquid turns to gas. Miraculously, it shrinks you and your subjects down to the size of mice. Already you hear your cats padding towards the frightened subjects. It looks as if you and your cats will really enjoy this little experiment. One that I personally like to call the digestive response of domestic felines to the introduction of Homo sapiens minutus. That's that's a pretty sweet title. I guess life would be easier if you were tiny though. You just get like a dollhouse. Yeah, it's cheaper or than you a real be, house. Yeah, but it would be it big would be enough. big and also just have a normal house. That would be ridiculously stupid. So. Mm. Imagine trying to get upstairs. Yeah, if you just. Right now, my explorer is still in the game. I'm just small like everyone else. If there are three or four players, I get one cat, so I have one cat. That sucks. Wait, is there five of us? There might be five of us. Fuck yeah, I got two cats. Shit, yeah. Wait, I know about the heroes. They're trying to escape in a toy airplane. That's fucking stupid. What are they gonna do when they fucking get outside? They're still gonna be fucking small. I'm pretty sure I'm the only one who knows the cure. So they're retarded. I win when more than half the heroes have been eaten by my cats. Success. Uh, all items and omens they're carrying have shrunk with you and function normally. You must make a might roll of three plus to go up or down the stairs. If you fail, you end your turn. We can try again next time. Uh, you can't use a collapsed room, mystic elevator, ga and the uh, gallery, gymnasium, or vault doesn't affect me. Well, well it's, not like you can leave, it's, it's not like you can leave the stove on. Like the party party. Go to, yeah.
Twinkle the Rose. Except with fully well, yeah, functioning. Yeah, you, you couldn't cook anything with, like, at all. Fully, <laughs> like, with, like, fully you functioning You have to eat, like, little plastic food. <laughs> no, you have, to, you have to build into the dollhouse fully functioning anemones. Are we having a conversation about... Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Making well, a doll life would be like if you were a doll. Yeah. Huh. Then you could do the... I'm a Mr. Bobby girl. Why would you want... <laughs> why is that... Uh, cats. My fucking cats are powerful. They got speed of six, might of seven, sanity of five, knowledge of five. Cats count each doorway as a space the same as explorers do. Cat can catch only one hero at a time. Hmm, that's bullshit. Special attacks, you can't attack explorers. You want your cats to eat them instead. Well, okay then. When a cat defeats a hero, it plays cat and mouse. Why can't I just fucking eat it? Damn it. Damn cats and their playful attitude. With that hero, and then, yeah, so it doesn't do any damage. And that can your hero's next turn, you can attempt to escape. They will tell me how. There's a cat right there. He's gonna fucking eat them all. Guaranteed. I get two. So they're bullshitted. If anyone defeats the cat before the cat's next turn, the cat drops the captured hero and is stunned. Otherwise, that swallows and kills them. Like a powerful cat should. A cat in the same room as the toy plane can attempt a speed roll of plus seven to bat it down. A cat can immediately attack a hero in the toy airplane. You can also attempt to knock down the plane, needing a speed roll of 5+. plus. Well, shit. Well, I don't remember what my speed is, and I don't think it's that good. You can brush, brush your, your hair, hair and stuff and dress me everywhere. Like some plastic. It's fantastic. Is that the song? <laughs> yeah, that's Barbie Girl. <laughs> yeah, it is. What? If you win, it will take months to analyze all of the data. But one thing is clear, your cats consider this experiment a great success. Well, that's good. There's a cat right there. Physics! Oh, there we go. Spooky cat cam. Let's go kill some bitches. Yeah, I dropped it. Oh, 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 here he comes. All right. Do you need cats? The traitor has returned. Oh, no. Oh, Don't give things away. Uh. What? I'm pretty sure he, just, he knows he that just cats. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, can we next time, recording? we'll continue our game, and we'll, we'll see what happens. We'll see if you guys remember all the stuff that we just said. <laughs> yeah, they can yeah. play it back. Yeah, yeah. Thanks for watching. I need two cats. Yeah, bro. Hey, no! We're okay. stopping. <laughs>